like him to be able to kind of slow the game down in the second half and kind of take them out of them. What was the big adjustment that you think you guys made? Well, we failed to be physical in the first half. Um, you know, we want to run the ball for a couple of reasons. That's what we do. Keep the ball away from your opponent because they have a high powered offense. It's not really a good way to start the game. Up. I have no idea how long that kickoff return is. I'll find out when they're on and go back. Um, but we just don't, hey, we're just going to match up with them. We're just going to play defense. We're play defense. Uh, okay. Sacks are great, but pressure on the quarterback and make him throw off his back foot and make him unsure of himself is just as good. And I challenge, hey, I think they're all in. Maybe we can't play with these guys. Because things got away from us. So you can play with them. You're just as good. We can play. And we played. And we played well in the second half. And then, Coach, maybe you think you guys had lost the game. McGowan makes that catch down to the oh, four yard absolutely. line. And then we illegal formation, by the way. So, well, you know, I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to say we pride ourselves stuff because we don't. But we always tell them one play at a time, one series at a time, one game at a time. And that's all it is. The best way to play, and I said this last week. Uh, I'm not sure it was the Danny or Phil you guys. Is, we're going to play like you're playing out in the street. And we're going to play until they turn the street lights off. They didn't turn them off. We still got to play. Uh, on the first play of the game, Cooper almost had a long touchdown, and then he breaks that fourth yeah. and, the, and the play we threw down here for the touchdown and for the two point was the exact same. We just flipped it. Just power right past, and then power left past. And of course, first play of the game, offensively, you just have a touchdown go go off your hands, and then it kind of seemed like it totally flipped on the last drive. You make that big catch. Um, just did you feel like you were kind of getting some redemption? Yeah, I kind of. I just I just took that out of my mind, moved on, moved on to the next play, and we we knew we'd come back and we'd hit him again for a big one. Can you guys just you know that crazy end of the game. I mean, they made that big reception down to the five-yard line. It looks like they might win, but you guys are able to come right back in the overtime. Just you guys being able to stick together um, at the end of the game. Yeah, we're just we're, that, that's what we preach: resiliency. You know, we uh, we all we all we're all the, for the team. We're not individuals. We we feel like we have the opportunity to win every game if we play at that level. You know, five times in a row, you guys have won the. the uh, the sectional and the conference, of course, too. I see you throw up the X after that touchdown there. I mean, what does it mean for Zavarian to, to get this to get this win over a rival? Uh, we always say the uh, the Catholic Conference in the Division One South runs through uh, Clapboard Tree Street, and we want to keep that going as long as possible because we know that we're the best team, and we have to prove it every week. How do you guys avoid a start like this? Um, I mean, there was a couple mistakes. You know, you gotta you gotta adjust. It took a little bit of adjusting at, at halftime, you know, and we really, we really came back and, and showed some serious resiliency right there at the end. As a leader, what do you and the other guys prepared. do to kind of rally the team, get everybody back on track after? Um, you know, all, it's all positivity. That's that's what we preach, you know. Uh, all the captains, even the quarterback, right, Michael Baluti, he's a sophomore, but we wanted to keep everyone up. He was helping keep everyone up. The sideline was going crazy uh, for us the whole game, and we just wanted to, to keep the energy up so we because we knew we could come back and win. I just want to let you get out of here. Talk about Baluti's performance, especially in the second half. Uh, you know, he's a hell of a player, sophomore, coming in, learning learning all the plays, new offense. Uh, new offensive coordinator, you know, he, he, he knows what he's doing. He's a hell of a player.